I, I am all still as slips, and so this is one and uh, one one funny thing about magnets. Another interesting idea of looking at a piece of humble magnet is 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 very windy. Is this? Now we have the space in the whoa. We have the space in the vertical fashion. We have the space in the vertical fashion. And this is more difficult than I first would imagine. Let's cover up everything so no one would, would know what we are building. I, well, space in a vertical fashion. There is the uh, there is our gas here. A space in the horizontal fashion, and the gas. I I put it just it just coincidence. The vertical fashion. We have another yes here that I put a dot line to represent time and the scale the scale of time starts from zero o'clock to one o'clock and it's just an idea when the piece of magnet is at the scale of time somewhere between zero and one o'clock what if the energy representation of this magnet is somewhere lower and somewhere somehow higher of the physical magnet that the, the result would be unthinkable so I would try to look at well if I try to dip into our uh, little purse perch now we have we have it's very difficult to do well it will get us nowhere because of the wind now 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 I have this original magnet here I would try to cut this magnet into an interesting shapes. I would I would cut an imaginary hole right there. See there. To represent the funny phenomenon of physical magnets north, however its energy representation is south. And physical magnet is north energy representation is south. This is what those hole is doing. Since this magnet is cut out of the funny shapes of the original magnet, you can look at it this way. See the shape is being being cut into a artificial fashions. Now these guys would be cut in a in in likewise but in the opposite directions now that's what we will try to force the magnets to do we will force these magnets to go this way and we'll try to force these magnets to go the other way So we will we will arrive at this diagram here. The orange area represents I call it the drain, the hole. That's where the action should be most intense. This is the piece of magnet. The dot line represents the center of balance. 
that's where the north and south are organized. So we have the hole here, we have the balance here, we have the magnets being cut uh, artificially into a special shapes. Oops. We will come down to this, we will zoom in to the to where the center of balance is. I will further simplify down into columns. So this is the original south we have been looking at, that's the north, that's the center of balance, and that's the that's that's the active area of the magnets. So this is my my way of mathematically trying to resolve these problems. So I have left my mathematics behind for a very, very long time. So this will be way off. I have the south and north here. That still remain the center of balance right here. And that's where the action go, and that's how the how the whole motor spins. However, the north and south, north and south, for the magnets try to fight for its survival and fight for its balance. The physical magnets may the physical magnets may be south, but however, the magnets want its an energy representation to take a north turn. The physical magnets may be north, however the magnets would want would have to have a south energy representation. Now, the zero stands for original. One stands for a newly established newly established magnetical field. The zero the zero is go according to the original magnets. South, south. No, no. However, the knob is going against the original magnet. In terms of electronics, zero represents switch off, one represents switch on. That's how we switch on the whole motor, by, by flipping the physical and the energy representation of the magnet. See, there is a con there is a conflict in north is going against the physical magnet. However, the energy representation wants north. This also have the problem with south and north, and there will be there will be a years for the magnet to neutralize itself in this fashion. So that's that's basically what spin the magnetic motor as far as we can tell and we are not quite there to 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 reach the the sand of time just yet it's just it's just way too earlier to 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 try to to take a look of the scale of time but however time does not seems to be